I'm going to tell you about Sarah. Sarah was a student here at the University of Nebraska-Lincoln who had not yet been able to secure her full-time employment after graduation. She had taken all of the right courses and was on the exact path she had been promised would lead to a career. But despite all of that, didn't have an offer waiting for her yet. It seemed the problem was that even positions listed as entry level required some prior experience. Some of her peers were lucky enough to have summer internships, and some employers would count that. But it seemed this was a chicken and egg problem. How could she gain the experience she needed to enter the workforce if even entry-level jobs required experience? Everyone told her she needed to network, to make connections in the industry. But how and where exactly was she supposed to make these connections? Then Sarah applied and was accepted into the Jeffrey S. Rick School Design Studio here at the University of Nebraska-Lincoln, a capstone program that's been bringing career-focused students and industry partners together for 20 years. Founded in 1999, the Rake School's focus has always been how computer science and management together can create the next generation of innovative leaders in industry. Named after Nebraska native Jeff Rakes, who after a distinguished career at Microsoft, still spends time at his family farm here in eastern Nebraska, and who is still very active with the school. Our capstone program in the school is Design Studio, where we pair teams of five students with corporate sponsors on year-long product development projects. These projects aren't intern work. They're real and meaningful work, giving our students an unprecedented opportunity to gain real-world experience before completing their undergraduate degree. I'm going to tell you next about a project with Fiserv, a global leader in fintech. The Design Studio team was challenged to work with a technology that was truly bleeding edge. I'm talking about the type of technology where if documentation is available, it's changing daily. Where there aren't even questions about it on Stack Overflow yet, much less solutions. And the team really attacked that problem, figuring it out through curiosity and perseverance. But of course, this led to several direction changes in the project as roadblocks were found and then worked around. The students came to me desperate, wondering with all of the technical setbacks, how could their project ever be considered a success? They were convinced it was a failure. They'd never make it to where the sponsor had asked them to go originally. But what they didn't realize was their project was already a success. What the students had discovered about how to make this technology work was incredibly valuable and would have cost the sponsor much more to discover on their own. The students were only defining success from the end product, but the sponsor was valuing the intentional learning and discovery that happened along the way. I also want to share a little bit about Huddle, a leading athletic performance analysis company founded right here in Lincoln in 2006. Today, Huddle's products empower more than 180,000 sports teams across the globe, but their beginnings are much more humble. You see, the three founders of Huddle are all graduates of the Rake School and Huddle's first version was created in a design studio project. We, of course, aren't the only ones experimenting with real-world experience in higher education. Much of our own inspiration came from the clinic program at Harvey Mudd College in Claremont, California. And programs like the Career Academy at Lincoln Public Schools are experimenting with this same idea in secondary education. But you might be wondering what happened to Sarah. 
through her experience in Design Studio, she was able to both gain the experience and make the connections needed to find her first job and to start her career. We're excited to help students like Sarah every year, giving them a brighter future with intentional experience before graduation. We are proud of our 100% placement rate out of the rig school, while nationally two thirds of college graduates struggle to find employment. And we think we're onto something in this new idea of real world education.